Hi there. We're about to release a pelican. Uh, this bird was brought into us with a head injury. He's all healed up now. We're about to give him his goodbye meal of two fresh fish and drop him off with the rest of his migratory flock. This pelican came to us with a head injury. He had flown into a power line. Our first step was to just give him some time to recover. Next, we wanted to make sure that he got a full meal before we released him back into the wild. Yeah. Alright, go ahead. Oh, I love it. There we go. Whoa, that's close. You made me nervous on that one, buddy. Good thing you're a grip already. <laughs> that thing just went right away, didn't it? Our third job was to go ahead and send him on his way. It was important that he get the opportunity to hook up with a flock of pelicans already flying south on their annual migration to the Gulf of Mexico. There is a local lake that's a popular stopping point for many migratory birds as they venture north to south during this time of year. He says, is it fish time? You got any fish? It's an unfortunate fact that all God's creatures prefer free meals and the general couch potato lifestyle. And it can take some time to convince a released animal that it's time to return to the majestic wild. There we go. <laughs> well, <laughs> tell me he's not coming back. Oh my, you gotta be kidding me. This is what Operation Wildlife is all about. Giving a second chance to an animal injured as a result of living side by side with human beings. This healed and healthy bird stands an excellent chance of resuming the life that nature intended. We receive and rehabilitate hundreds of animals every year. We invite you to become part of our ongoing work to heal, to educate, and to make amends. Thanks for watching.